Hello, everybody. I'm reading to you from the car again today where it's nice and quiet. I'm going to read you two books about our friend the duck, Zachary Quack. The first one is Zachary Quack, Mini Monster. Climbing the riverbank onto the track went pitchery patchery Zachary Quack. He scruffled a centipede out of his house. He pestered a spider and ruffled a mouse. He bustled a beetle asleep on a chair and hustled a dragonfly into the air. Flick went the dragonfly, flick, 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 here, there, and everywhere, quick, quick, quick. Over the path, and the rockery, too. Over some paint and a bottle of glue. Flick went the dragonfly, flick, 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 here, there, and everywhere, quick, quick, quick. Through the petunias, pumpkins, and peas, Heavens, <laughs> we need a new book. <laughs> Over the rake and a mountain of leaves. Flick went the dragonfly, flick, flick, flick. Here, there, and everywhere, quick, quick, quick. Over the sand pit, around the old swing, The netting and potting mix tied up with string. Flick went the dragonfly, flick, flick, flick. Back to the riverbank, quick, quick, quick. <laughs> Okay, the next one is Harry McClary and Zachary Quack. If you remember, Harry McClary looks just like Edison, my doggy. It was drowsily warm with dozens of bees, lazily buzzing through flowers and trees. Harry McClary decided to choose a space in the shade for his afternoon snooze. He dozily dreamed as he lay on his back. Whoop, I've missed some. When Pitchery Patry Skittery Scattery Zip Round the Corner came Zachary Quack. Who wanted to frolic and footle and play, but Harry McClary skedaddled away. Over the lawn and asparagus bed went Harry McClary to hide in the shed. He lurked in the shadows, all dusty and black, but... Pitchery, patchery, skittery, scattery, zip round the corner came Zachary Quack. Out of the garden and into the trees jumped Harry McClary with springs in his knees. He hid in the grass at the side of the track, but... <laughs> Pitchery, pattery, skittery, scattery, zip round the corner, came Zachary Quack. Down to the river, through willow and reed, raced Harry McClary at double the speed. Into the water, he flew with a smack. But... Pitchery, pattery, skittery, scattery, zip round the corner, came Zachary Quack, who dizzily dived in the craziest way whirling and swirling in showers of spray. Harry McClary was off in a flash, a flurry of bubbles, a dog paddle splash. He swam to the side and floundered about. He tried and he tried, but he couldn't climb out. Scrabbling upwards and slithering back, when... Pitchery, patchery, skittery, scattery, zip through the water came Zachary Quack, who 
who sped round a corner and showing the way, led Harry McClary up, up, and away. Then, soggy and shivering back up the track, went Harry McClary with Zachary Quack. It was drowsily warm with dozens of bees lazily buzzing through flowers and trees. Harry McClary decided to choose a place in the shade for his afternoon snooze. He dozily dreamed as he lay on his back, tucked up together with Zachary Quack. <laughs> there you go. Those are our stories for the day. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.